So when it comes to setting up your roof for your fall protection, you have to set up the anchors in ways that prevent your, your swing, your pendulum swing. Um, so typically on a, on a residential roof, you're gonna have more than one set of anchors installed um, because you can't, you can't put one 40 feet away and then be working over here because if you swing, if you fall, all of a sudden your, your rope is way too long and you're hitting the ground. So you set up multiple anchor points so that you can adjust your rope, again, to have it at the proper length for what you're working on. So as I start to walk 20 feet over there, what am I doing? I'm starting to walk up towards the peak again because I only have so much rope, right? So what do they do? Well, you know what they do. They grab yield rope grab and pay out 20 more feet of rope. Then they get over there and they fall. I don't care who you pray to in the morning. I don't care what you eat for breakfast. You ain't staying. You know why? Gravity, gravity never stops. So what's it gonna do? It's gonna bring you right back to where? It has to bring you back to zero. It has to bring you to zero. There's no question, okay? The only problem is, the second biggest word I know, inertia. You started at A, you got to B, do you think you stop? No, you go to C and you go back. We call it the pendulum effect. Happens all the time, why? Because they don't wanna move their anchor. It's too much of a hassle. So what we come up with is a couple of ideas. By the way, if you go 20 this way and 20 that way, you're 40. And if you're only 30 feet off the ground, you don't have, you got more rope than you got air. So you're gonna hit the ground. We call that the splat factor. When you're up on a roof, if you're not gonna put a rat line up or a horizontal life line up, right? Take four or five anchors and put them up there all the way across the roof. Hook off to this first anchor. Okay, that's your anchor point, right? But I need to work over at that, over on this side, and it's out of my swing fall. Because we give you 30 degrees. From zero, we give you eight to 10 feet. So put another anchor 20 feet. You got 10 from this one, 10 from that one, right? Then walk over to that anchor, pull a carabiner out of your pocket, put it in the anchor, and put your rope through it. Where's your new anchor? Right here. You can do that as far as you got rope. And then you just come back, but you're always tied off. And it gives them freedom, especially guys doing tear off. So it gives them freedom.